guys what's up shadow queen here back with another video welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be telling you a story about what happened at the age of 19 years old with me on instagram i was catfish just, i'm just letting you guys know this is, okay so okay let me guys tell you okay so at the age of 19 years old i was catfished i was confronted by three different accounts on instagram now us I know everybody on Instagram has has Instagram of course it's become quite popular recently recently everybody is on there other than Facebook and Twitter and stuff like that this mainly mainly the bombing um, social media of all time but anyways um okay so at that at that age I had been confronted with three different accounts um one account was named Johnson another account was named Darren Jones and the last account I don't even remember but anyways <clears throat> I don't even remember but hey okay so um those three accounts okay so they started acting weird they talk they started talking weird like every every um every sentence they would um begin with let's start with that period 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 at every last sentence like i'm gonna give you an, i'm gonna give you guys an example like if they'd say hi it'd be like a period and it'd be like a word period word period word period so i thought that was kind of strange um. also i'd request i'd request for for um guys you know normally I don't know about you guys but i'm a person i like to know who i'm talking to so i'd request for um voice messages voice recordings or possibly facetime would be correct with me to actually know who i'm talking to and if it's the person properly who i'm talking to and they would deny me of that request they'd come up with excuses in order to make me forget or to change the subject they'd say oh one of them would say oh i can't talk to you right now i'm at church you can't talk to me right now you're at church but you're texting my phone another person would say oh i'm grounded my mother took my phone so if you're grounded how are you texting me right now that's strange i'd okay so i'm Okay, so another person said, oh, I'm a singer and I sing. I was like, oh, okay, so let me hear you sing. So send, a, send a voice message and let me hear you sing. Then they're telling me, oh, my, my voice is bad. I can't talk right now. I was like, I was like, oh, okay. I was like, okay. I was like, you know what? I was like, excuse me. Hold on. Let me adjust the camera. Got it. Okay. I was like, no, know what? Let me tell, I was like, let me tell you something. I was like, y'all think I'm, y'all think y'all slick. I was like, let me tell you something. This is my first, this is my first time ever actually experiencing this. But y'all think y'all slick. Y'all think I don't know. I was like, I don't, I was like, I never, because I'm a person. I've never been catfished before. This is actually my first time being catfished. I've seen, I don't know if y'all know this, this, this um show is called Catfish with matt and matthew i forgot i don't know the, i don't remember their names but um there's a show called catfish where you know people they discover who they're talking to and it's not the person they're, to, they're actually they've been actually been conversing with it's either been somebody's brother or somebody's sister or somebody's family member they've been talking to um but uh, i've never been catfish before and that was actually my first time but i've actually learned my lesson from that I don't, every time I see a fake account on Instagram, I do not add it because I never know, like I said, you never know who you could be talking to. Also, do not put your location on your account because that's how people can find you and you don't know who you, who exactly that person is who's actually trying to find you. You don't even know if they're real. Also, um, people okay on okay on on instagram right people take other people's pictures i don't know if you guys know people take other people's pictures from off their account 
and screenshot it and put it on their account, on the fake account. The way you can know when an account is fake, how blurred it is, how blurry it is, and how much followers they have. So if they have one follower, or if their their um their picture on there is mad blurry, is mad blurry, then it, it's a fake account. It's, it's really a fake, fake account. If it has not, if it doesn't have that much many followers, it's, it's a, fake a fake account. account. Do not add it. Okay. Yeah, but what if it is not a fake account? It don't matter. You don't know the person. Why are you adding them? Okay. Um, I have a question too. So basically, if you if you see it's not Louie, if you see a account that's not Louie, and it's still a fake account, does that does that mean like like you're cash being catch catfish? Yes, you're being catfish because it's a person. Okay, so I'm gonna give you an example. Okay, if it's not okay, so if this person okay, I'm gonna give you an example. If this person okay, if this person is not requesting. Okay, and usually a person requests, like, I'm a, per, all right, so I'm a person, and I request um, FaceTime or voice message to hear, to hear what you sound like, or I actually request for you to take a picture, but it's a fake, it's a fake picture, it's not really a picture of you, it's a picture of someone else, someone else who you took, someone else's picture you took, and you placed it in the messages to talk to me. So it's not. It's not actually you, who who you who I'm speaking to. It's okay. It's not actually the person who I'm speaking to. It's you, but it's not who you are. It's not your actual. It's not actually what you look like or what you appear to be acting that way. Let me tell you. After this, let me tell you. After I found out. After it, yeah, after it was catfish, I started looking it up and I started noticing some behaviors that adjusted that didn't sit right with me. Um, so those two accounts, right? I have another question that for you when you were being catfish, those two accounts, right? How long did you ta- how long did it take for you to find out that it you were being catfish. that you were being a, that you were that you or being like being catfish. Being catfish. Well I'ma let well I'ma let y'all know. I I had gotten in trouble for it because as I as, I don't know if y'all parents tell you this, but there's people who are predators out there and they like they like little kids. they like little kids. They like all times or ages, younger and older. And I was in i am let me tell you, I got in trouble for it, so I did, you know. I didn't, I'm gonna tell you, I got in trouble for it. One more question. Because <laughs> I did. One more question. Um, what if the um thing is not the thing is not the the thing is blurry, right? And it the um the picture is blurry, and it's, they're not actual. They're not an actual catfish. What? Well, what will you do in that like situation? Mostly, most mainly on my account that I have on Instagram, I mainly add people of interest who like the same things I like, like songwriting, singing, stuff like that. But I make sure it's actually the person who I'm adding. I look at all their their pictures, their their videos, and make sure it's actually them. Even they, even sometimes they even go on live stream, and I check out their thing to make it sure it's the person I'm actually seeing, because people who are who are who are talking to at that age, they never live stream either. They never did live stream. They never took videos, and even if it was videos or pictures, it wasn't theirs. That it didn't belong to them. It belonged to someone else. So. Yeah. Okay. And I'm also gonna do a skit after this. I'm also gonna do a skit, and I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna text you guys. No, not text you guys. I'm going to do a skit after this, and I'm gonna um um explain it. I'm gonna put up information about catfishing 
and stuff like that. We'll take pictures and stuff like that. Uh, one more question. Zoe, did you have a question for yes. us before we go? Have you ever got more catfish? Like, any? any did you ever get catfish again? After this moment, I have not. Thank God. And even if I did, I know not to answer it because... Yes. Do they still make no, fake accounts? People make fake accounts all the time. On you? No. Oh, okay. On other people? Repro- they have, but it's old. Oh. And I report them. Um, I've, yeah, I've had like three fake accounts made of me. Um, and I make sure to report them, scam, everything. Block. Okay. One more question. One more. I swear that's the only question. Um. Okay. So... When you get, is that the only time you had get got catfish? You haven't got catfish any other time you of age, like when you were like eighteen. No, that was the only time. Nineteen, nineteen was my limit. Nineteen. That's it. No more. Every okay. time I see a, every time every time I see a fake account, I don't I, I don't answer it. I block it. Yeah. Okay. Or um, I delete it. Yeah. So you learn your lesson. <laughs> Well, at least you didn't do it again. Um, at least you, you learned about... Also, yeah, I'm a, and I'm going to tell you guys something. When your parents is telling you something, you need to listen to them because they know more than you. They're telling you the right thing. They're telling you the right thing. So they could Don't think you, you full of it. Don't think you full of it and say, oh, okay, I'm going to do this. No, no. They're telling you the right thing because probably... You may not know this, but probably this may have may have happened to them, and you don't know. And they're telling you this to make you learn from their mistakes and to protect you. And to protect you, you're right. So, I'm gonna leave you with three advices. Be careful who you add on Instagram. Mm-hmm. Not only on Instagram, on any other on like, any like other Facebook. on any other social media that you have, TikTok, whatever. Like Facebook, Especially Snapchat, anything. Snapchat, yeah. Yeah. Instagram, yeah. Facebook, social media. Sorry. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Facebook, social media, Snapchat, Snapchat, and Instagram. Oh. Or any other sites that you mainly discovered or anything like that. Be careful. Be careful of the location you share. Yes. Do not send any private pictures that cannot be erased. Because once you put something on the internet, it cannot be erased. I know y'all parents tell you this, and you need to listen to them because it's the truth. Yes. I've never done anything foul, foul in my life, but I'm just a, I'm just giving you an example. Honestly, I'm just a kid, so. Okay, so I'm going to leave you with that. Be careful who you trust on Instagram. Be careful who you add on Instagram, and be careful who you speak to. Honest. If you do not know this person, if you do not see, if you have not seen the face, if you have not called the person and the person has not called you, if they not haven't given you their number, because they give you fake numbers. Let me tell you, they gave me a fake number, and I was smart enough to, I was smart enough to make sure, because I'm not dumb. I know what's a fake number, and I don't know what's not a fake number. And I called that shit. That shit went straight to voicemail. That shit said, this shit is not in service. That's how you know it's a fake account. Did they put a one? Yeah, they put a one. I, I like. I, the, the person said, "I was like, so, so let me say, let me, can I can you give me your Facebook? Can me can you give me your um number. Can, your number so I can call you?" He's like, "Oh yeah, okay." I was like, "Okay, I'll, I'll be I'll waiting for it." And he sent me it. I called the, the person. The, the thing the thing said, "Oh this this phone is not in service. This phone don't work." Did you? That's how it? you know. Uh huh. The person didn't call me. It's fake. It's a fake number. Oh, how do they even make fake numbers? There's a way. Yeah, there's a way, and no one People knows. all got resources, all kind time. of resources nowadays. But, yeah. Um, be careful, be aware, and be... Safe. Yeah, be safe. And I'm... Okay, yeah. After you <laughs> subscribe, like, and comment on this video and what you thought about it. And I'm going to see you guys later. Bye, guys. Bye-bye. Thank you for joining. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hey guys, what's up? Shy Girl Queen here back with another video. Today I'm going to be doing Instagram dating horror story animated. Also, please, after this video, please subscribe to and when see horror story animated as well. And let's get into the video. I was a big Tinder guy a few years ago. Mm-hmm. Everywhere I went, I would update my location and then up. Listen, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
on any platform of social media, never, ever, 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 ever put your location on any platform on social media because that's not a wise thing to do. People could find you right then and there, okay? That's not a good idea. So that, that was the first step that he did wrong. Let's continue. Date, you know, my body count. Then I quit doing Tinder and stuck with Instagram. We all hooked up on Instagram all of a sudden. I know, they're completely different. And IG has a bunch of fake accounts. You hear what the person said though? Fake accounts. How you know this is not a fake one? Like, come on, man. Come on, dude. What are you doing? So I saw this girl commenting on all of my friends' pictures. Then she commented on mine. She, okay. She, I, okay, I understand. Okay, so she commented on all your friends' pictures, and then she commented on yours. But, but that don't mean that, you know, you know this person, and, and this person knows you. Okay, you don't know this person. You don't know. Come on, man. Come on, dude. What are you doing? I also saw my friends replying, so I figured... Another thing. Just because your friends are, comment are replying to that person doesn't mean they know that person either. Like, come on, dude. You don't know that person. Your friends don't know that person. Like, come on, man. None of y'all know each other. She was a real person because I looked on her page and she had way more followers. Listen, listen. That's another thing. The follower section, this person could have stole other people's followers. You don't know. You don't know these kind of things. You don't. Listen, you don't know. You don't know. Let me tell. Let me, but after this, I'm going to tell you a story that happened to me. After this. And people she was following. Boo -boo. So I DM'd her. I definitely thought she wasn't going to reply, but she did within an hour. Replied mad quick too. We talked for maybe two or three weeks and we made it official. She two was or pretty, three weeks? Had a three weeks? You barely even know the person. Job, what? Like she said. I felt she was out That's of my league lot. and too perfect. Every day she posted new photos. And I told my friends about her and they seemed pretty jealous, except for my friend Ryan. He said I was stupid because I never spoke with her. And yup, he right. He tell he telling you the right thing. Like you haven't listen, you haven't spoke to her on the phone, you haven't seen her in person. You don't even know if those pictures are real. Those pictures are probably screenshotted and ha added to that account. Listen, when when pe when you when I noticed like when people are on Facebook and they create these fake accounts they take people's pictures off the 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 real account the real account that they take pictures off the real account that's there and they put it place the um the stolen picture that was from that real account on a fake account and present it as someone else this is what they do this is what they're doing so your friend is telling you the right thing your friend is telling you how you how are you conversing with this person you haven't spoke to this person on the phone and you haven't seen this person in real life. You all you see is pictures on all you see is pictures on this 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 account. You don't even know if that person is the real person. Like come on, bro. Come on, dude. Come on, come on. What are you what are you doing, bro? I only messaged her. She invited only me. Only messaged her, she said that's she it. Ryan told me to don't go. The rest of my friends Brian said, telling you right. Kids, you need to listen to Brian. Laugh. So I went over there, but not without Ryan calling me a clown first. Dumbass. Look, the GPS dumb. says she lived about an hour away. He dumb. When I first started to talk to her, she told me that she lived in a nice neighborhood. That's clearly a lie. But when I got there, look, look at it. Look. There were people everywhere, and the neighborhood was not that this nice. This is what you call nice. This is what when you I call stopped a nice at the stop sign at the corner, people walked up to my windows and asked me, what do I need? But I pulled off really fast and got to the house. It was a duplex. That looked nothing like so the I house you're talking her, about. And she said to come up the stairs. Come up the stairs. It was about nine at night and people were everywhere just standing around. I knocked on the door and I was definitely excited. The door opened into my... Oh my God, he ugly. Oh my God. Run! Run! Run while you still can, boy! Run! Surprise, it was a bald headed white guy with a patchy beard. Oh, hell no! Oh. Holding his head with a tank top on. 
don't know. I don't know. I asked, was Lisa home? And he said, yeah. Listen, listen. Okay. Listen, if the person who you were speaking to isn't the person who answered that door, that should have been your first clue to be like, oh, hell no. This is not even her house. This is a fake account. This is, this is, this was, this was provoked by a fake account. That should have been your first clue. If you've seen a man open the door and it's not the person you was talking to, you should have been like, okay, let me dip. What? 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 Let's continue. Hmm. Come in. Come when in. When I walked in. Come in. I That's him, bro. I was hit with a musty smell mixed with My cheese. My God. He told it me to like sit down. the house down. hasn't been clean in and days. he sat down across from me on the couch. He said she'll be out soon. She'll be out soon. That's him. He asked me did I want something to drink and I said, yeah, sure. When I got up, I texted her, can she come out, please? Watch it, watch she it, watch it. She immediately said yes. Oh. The man came back in with two cups of juice. One for him and one for myself. Don't drink that. You better not drink that. Then I that. noticed that he put a phone down on the table next to him. Don't drink that. So I acted like I sneezed and got some on my arm. Listen, you... Another thing, you barely even know this person and you drinking out of their cup. They, they probably didn't even clean that cup and you they giving it to you. You you don't even know what they have in the cup and you drinking it, bro. What is this dude doing? What is this dude doing, bro? Bro. Then I asked for a tissue. He went to get some tissue and he left his phone like I thought he would. I, I, now here I goes the back into my Here goes the part. Here goes the part. Watch, watch it, watch him, watch him, watch him. Or the phone rang. Uh, da, 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 I da. looked on the caller ID and it was my name. Uh, I heard him coming back. He came back and we sat there for about a minute. And then the phone rang again because he never checked the message that I sent. Oh, no, nah, about to go he down. Looked at the phone. I looked at the phone. phone. Then we looked, looked at, at each, each other. other. I postured up. Oh, hell and he no. Me, said, Get I to guess top. Mm -hmm. Then out of nowhere, he lunged toward me, attempting to grab me. K.O. And he fell on his face. Oh, that was a good head, though. His jaw came out. He I knocked never looked out. Back. They got knocked yeah, I called out. The cops. You got knocked the fuck out, got bro. There, the man was still knocked out. Knocked out. After that, K I never went on dates with people that I met online. As you should. You shouldn't be doing that, period.